here's my thing too so the builders um know that you know people are making we're in in contract there's mm -hmm. a lot of people backing out yes and it's because too. of interest rates because mm -hmm. of this is not um you know we had a, a credit boom we will say back in 2002 to 2005 and it really contributed to our housing market you know getting a lot of inventory builders backed in over built Overbuilt. homes yeah now they're not doing that okay. yet that still was my question yeah, yeah still and that's what i was saying is still what's happening in this market though is that the the how fast rates went up and that's this, the thing this perfect storm of mm -hmm. higher uh, uh home prices yeah. higher uh interest yeah. rates it's now telling people hey you know what yeah. i just got to back out it's a perfect storm for people to leave yeah. the market so you're seeing builders now they're really going okay we have all this these properties that are yeah. being built and now they're in a position they're, that they got to get be, rid because of because it inventory. changed so quickly right. like the market's going up until it's not anymore right right and right now is that tilting point we're at that tilting point right now. So I'm not going to sit here and say the market's going to go down 15 or 20%. And to be honest with you, even if it did, people who bought in the last year, year and a half are fine. Because, you know, but what I am saying is that you're starting to see, especially builders, that that everything changed so quickly, they need to get rid of it. And well, no matter what the market is, there's always going to be buyers. Yep, always. Absolutely. It's just, it's just, it may be less, it may be farther and few mm -hmm. between, but there's always, it, whether it's at the very top or the very bottom, you, what yeah. I've noticed I, is someone's always going to buy a house. If they want to buy it, they're going to buy it. And you know, most of, most of the time it's a, it's a higher end house. So it doesn't affect the, yeah. uh, the, yep. the higher end people anyway. Yep. So it's all about who's able to see these homes that are available. Right. And then we well, go back is. to marketing. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, right <laughs> now, so, so right now what I'm seeing is, is that purchase applications have declined. Yeah. Uh, yeah. As people, a lender, what do you people? Well, that's not even lending. It's just purchase applications, not just as lending, but just people offering homes and doing things. Yeah. You see this declining as well yeah. uh, over across the board. Now, uh, I just see that the economy is, is taking a step back or people in the in the market are taking a step back. That doesn't mean they're not going to buy. They just need to see this thing. Yeah. Okay. Is this is rates going to start to come down breathe. again? Are, they yeah, just need to peaked? see what's being what's, observed and what's going yeah, on. Yeah, just waiting to see what's playing yeah. out. They want to. It's it's new. It's a drastic change. So yeah. people always want to wait a moment. One hundred percent. Let's see how this yeah. groove happens and where I, it's going. I know the market changed, in. and I can tell you one in, one is a clear indication. I've been doing this long enough. When listing agents start emailing me, how the showing go? <laughs> you I'm, get that little. Dude, uh, I'm, I'm telling your, you uh, for for two years. Yeah. You half these agents you would submit an offer and you wouldn't even get a response that you sent the offer, let, right. a, let alone asking about the feedback. And now almost every showing I'm doing, I get from the listening agent, how'd the showing go? I'm like, dude, market's turned. <laughs> no, 100%. So That's true. Uh, I think when, you, when he's ask, asking this question, so has the market peaked? I think it's peaked, but I also feel like it's gonna continue to go up. We say this all the time. There's just not enough data out there. I don't think it's gonna go up. I think it's gonna be stagnant. We're we're actually in a at a time in history that's we've never we've never been here. I mean, if you look at the inflation mm -hmm. rate, you look at the interest rate, you look at the we've CPI, never had a market just going with stocks and homes continue for twelve years straight. No. For twelve years uh -huh. straight, dude, it's continued upwards, and that's what and, I'm saying. Everything goes up until and, it doesn't, and everything anymore. follows the curve from the Nasdaq, the Dow, the OTC. The, yeah. the the Bitcoin the the, yeah. the crypto I mean it's all following the same stuff.